Young people in the West Midlands rely on the education maintenance allowance as a means to stay in full-time learning. Up to £30 a week is available depending on your household income and offers financial support to students. However, the government's cutbacks have resulted in this financial aid being replaced with a much smaller fund that will reach only the most disadvantaged students. Over half of the 16 to 18 year olds in the local area are receiving the EMA. Just under 8,000 students are entitled to the maximum £30 a week because their families earn below £20,800 a year. At the Stoke-on-Trent Sixth Form College, around 1,000 young people receive the allowance. Um, EMA basically I get £30 a week and this allows me to get a travel card basically. For a month is £44, a week is £14. Uh, basically food, like £2 a day maybe. That's already like £26, £24 already. And the rest of it, I just buy books in case I need to buy some resources or performance study. I need to buy like, equipment and stuff. Yeah. With a few people from the college travelling to London to lobby against the cuts last week, what is the overall feeling among the students? I'm not actually quite sure what the government is trying to achieve because obviously if they're, stunting, they're basically stunting the next generation, there's going to be a generation where there are not many academically skilled people. They're only going to be maybe workforce like in factories, manual jobs, but you're not going to have skilled people because there are people who aspire to do great things and go to university, but tuition fees and EMA is just cutting their dreams off really because they're not able to pursue that. And how damaging could the scrapping of the EMA be on these young people's futures? Absolutely, it's a lifeline. We, now, we've been lucky, really, because we were in the pilot authorities who piloted EMA back in, mm, it must have been about 2002, 2003, I think. So our students have been accustomed to it for some time. Most of them use it for the very sensible purpose of, of, of buying uh, travel. So they buy buzz about tickets to get here, or they, they use it to buy a rail card. Without it, a great many of our students would find it extremely difficult to travel to college. However necessary the government felt this allowance was to students around the country, there is a reassurance that at least those most in need of financial support will still receive some money towards furthering their educations. Amy Bramwell, Staffs Live.